To most of us, the fashion industry is a mystery, reserved for cotton conscious and the artistically adept. For others, it's a way of life. For still more, it's an opportunity to break down barriers and make people just look silly. Just a nice normal fashion show here. That is intimate. I knew those baby papooses would come in one day or another. I might go down to Babies R Us and get myself one and just pop a mate in it. Be the talk of the town for a bit. I think this lady was gonna get dressed, uh, but she just, you know, she's having a fag outside and just wandered into the rubbish bins. And the designers thought, pop yourself on stage, love. Nice normal fashion show here. Just holding your head. They're really ahead of the game here. There they are, just heading off. Not ahead this time, she's holding a beach ball and she's got a beard. This is progressive. Could be an alien, uh, some kind of druid. I reckon all women are gonna have beards in a few years after watching this. They're gonna stop shaving. This is really gonna catch on. Women have been shaving too long, in my opinion. Bring back the bush. Nice, nice legs, nice shoes there, good walk, nice bow. Oh my god! Is this some kind of freak scientific accident? What kind of sicko did this? They're sentient, they're in pain. Someone get them help. So these are a few students from the local clown school who thought they'd try their luck at the fashion show. They forgot to fully take off their clown outfit though. <laughs> they got the rest of the stuff right, but some of them just could not put down the balloons. And why would you? Speaking of balloons, this is actual footage of Violet Beauregard uh, from the Charlie and the Chocolate Factory movie when she got sent away by the Impa Loompas to sort her out. And this is what happened backstage in Chocolate Factory. He's a smart man, Willy Wonka. He wouldn't have put her in that position if she couldn't have got out of it. Nice. She's also turned Asian, but that's alright. Side effects, you know. I'm liking the lady at the back there. Having a whale of a time. I think these are some of the stagehands, some of the disgruntled crew members who've been putting up marquees and they fell on them, you know, for the show. They thought to get to get everyone back, they just slipstream behind the models. She's loving it. And I think they got away with it too. People were laughing it up. They are intense. So what happened here was the designer just put a load of scraps of fabric in the middle of the room. It was a bold move, it was revolutionary, and said to the models, just try and make your own clothes. I'm sick of it. And they didn't do that well. And you can see it in their faces and in their walks. They are walking sheepishly. If they had tails, they would be between their legs thoroughly. Won't be happening again, this stunt. This poor woman just had a paddling pool dropped on her head by some rock and roll toddlers from a hotel room. She's trying to find help, and people are just standing there. Someone help the poor woman. Do you know what's really fashionable? Subscribing to this channel. Trust me, I'm ahead of the game. You'll be seeing it on the catwalks very soon.